was able to secure quite a large number of hard drives uh, essentially some large entity was throwing away a lot of this stuff of servers and other things this one, the method of um, destroying these hard drives is drilling through it um, as the whole layer, it didn't go through the board but it did go straight through the motor and this motor does not turn anymore and as you can tell a hard drive motor starts to spin very easily this one doesn't this little pin was in the center there, I wasn't sure if it was a screw up pin and this is not one of the motors that can remove some motors are made that you have screws on them and you can just remove them some method of fixing onto the body it appears this motor is integrated into the actual hard drive frame so they're pressing essentially I believe they're pressing the parts into a machine cavity in this casting and essentially fabricated the motor into this housing so I can't do very much um, with it now that it doesn't spin so I'm going to open it up let's have a look and there are multiple multiple designs of hard drive motors um, when I strip the variety I may go through them and just have a look at you know what they are what they are different capacities um, and probably just pop up them one by one and see you know again the rated RPMs and how much power they draw interesting it looks like while the drill was going through it hit the edge of this rotor and essentially caused it to spin and bite all the edges so it's pretty much grabbed up all of these there's no way i would have gotten this to spin this is the kind of damage that was done to the surface here with our grip pliers just to try getting this out so yeah this was never going to spin again interestingly it looks very very similar to the um, brushless motors for the um, computer case fans i got it out but i damaged it in the process uh, not that this was going to be useful anyway i tried to take out the uh, wires by plug in here and that end up knocking this up and that is, is completely damaged this whole piece here that is piece of the aluminum on the bottom here that broke out that is how this came out the aluminum broke out this thing is integrally pressed in and stuck uh, with whatever glue or whatever they used here this is not coming out while this is here and this piece is separate this really isn't coming out it looks like this just the wires and uh, this whole hub is just put in here into the gas piece as machine and probably epoxy and um, yes so in future anyone that's in the appropriate thing would probably be to cut the housing around here and just use that whole thing as your motto on this again it appears this is not a um, plastic um, resin or kind of uh, thermoset anything uh, it appears to be ceramic not 100% sure but it's brittle several places broke but it's weak I mean look at this this is a welding rod right this is nowhere close to the strength of a needing a magnet it uh, looks like a weak ceramic magnet so amazingly they apparently don't need near the near magnets or for whatever reason they're not used in the hard drive and one would have thought that we'd have several you know near the near magnets there are 12 of these here so maybe 12 of them spaced around here to match up with this and it all would have worked out apparently not